How's it going, everybody? Welcome back to another Simulat stream. Hopefully, everybody's having a fantastic Wednesday because I know that I am. Happy halfway through the week, everybody. We are going to be having our fun with a little bit of double grounded today. So we're going to be playing grounded here and then for a little while over on my Twitch channel as well. So welcome all. Bring you guys on over. Hopefully, everyone's having a grand old time. Welcome to the stream, everyone. Jelly Cass, how's it going? Titus, how are you doing? Dark Gamer, what's up? The boy plays. How you doing, Edgar? Great to see you, Dragon Knight. Welcome all. Welcome, welcome, welcome. All right. So today, we are going to be working on our lab a wee bit. We are going to be or our base a wee bit. We're going to be working on gathering some armor, all sorts of cool stuff. All righty. What am I doing? Why am I standing up here? What am I doing in here? I need to get out of here. All right. Let's get to it. Trevor, how's it going? Shout out to gaming, how you doing? Welcome to the stream, everyone. Hopefully you're having a good one. Okay, let us make a salad with lettuce. I wish we could make salads in this game, right? Grab a little bit of plant fiber, maybe some aphid honeydew. Well, I made a spider sad by jumping on top of it. It's still sad. It's it's really trying too, but it's not working. I'm gonna go over here. I'm gonna get a little bit of sleep, and then we'll zip line over to the other base. And we're gonna plan out some stuff to, that we're gonna be building today. Got some really exciting news. I went ahead and bought a brand new graphics card today, so it's the stream quality and everything like that is going to get a heck of a lot better. Um, come Friday. So really excited about that. You still think a vegetable garden would have been a great addition? Me too, Scott Rick. Me too. Definitely. Anyone else's screen black? Um, it shouldn't be. Try refreshing the, the screen? Or the, the stream? It shouldn't be. Because according to my preview that I'm seeing, it's not. Is anybody else having a black screen issue? Good boy, good boy, Squire McFluffin Poof. Very happy of, for, of you. All good on your end? You can't kill the assistant manager? You tried to use what you tried to use. All right, good to know. Nope, okay. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, everyone. Thank you for confirming for me. I always like just to make sure, you know, you never can be too safe. But let me tell you guys, I am so incredibly excited to get this new graphics card. I can't wait to slap it on in this PC and then just be that much better for all of you guys. I mean, if you guys were watching like my recent Resident Evil, me trying to play Astroneer, I mean, heck, even Grounded right now, if we look at my uh, my game settings, or not my game settings, my options, and I go to display and look at my graphics, I'm playing on low quality right now. Once that new graphics card gets thrown in there, I can bump this thing to high and it's still going to be just chugging. So... You used the Salt Morning Star? Uh, that should have been a good weapon to fight him with. Right? I mean, that should have been a good weapon to fight him with. Let's see. Assistant Manager. Yeah, Salt and Busting. That should have been a great... What, what level was your Salt Morning Star? And also, how many smoothies did you bring? Uh, what's my favorite weapon in the game? Um, Look-wise, the Termite Axe. Using-wise, the Salt Morning Star. Okay, so this room off to this side over here, this is going to be my armory. So this is where we want to build our armory today. So that's what we're going to be doing. I need to grab some grass plank floors. Here we go. Some nice grass floors. We need to get those guys down. Go ahead and put that down all in those. Oop, not, not there. Not, not there. We need some curved floors for that. Very good, very good, very good, very good. Let's see, how much stuff do I need? 134 grass planks, 132 weed stems, lots of clay, some sap, some dried grass, some some dry grass, not some dried grass. Hard speaking, yes. Crude rope, acorn shells, and mushroom bricks. Well, the mushroom bricks I'm not really worried about. This is all the grass planks that I need. You know what I'm going to do? 
I am going to zip over to my other base, and I'm actually going to grab my ant armor for today. We've been wanting me to grab my ant armor for a while, so we're definitely going to do that. Hey, Keith, how's it going? I'm going to do a quick refresh here, make sure that everything with my stream is loaded, so just give me a second. Okay, perfect. There we go. Everything appears to be working well. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. All right, let's do this. Brung two smoothies in your Salt Morning Star was level zero because he just got it. Okay, get your Salt Morning Star to level five. Don't go at it without a level five Salt Morning Star and bring at least 10 smoothies with you, not two, 10. Even if they're just question mark smoothies. Easiest way to get more smoothies, take a quick jump into the pond, grab yourself some muscle sprouts and make some more advanced smoothies. That's really gonna help you out there. Did you know that the 1.0 trailer, uh, some sort of white and blue light or is on top of the shed or something you can see the other things that are mysterious really that'd be interesting all right let's grab my ant armor i feel a little less squishy swap now. that out so we could do a little yeah you feel less squishy now that you're wearing crappy ant armor that's you're brilliant pete brilliant okay i can't make very much crude rope but we're gonna get it going anyway all right, I really got to rename these chests. I know I'm going to need some more clay. And I'm going to need really nothing that's in any of these. Oh, there's some rope right there. Let me grab all that. I need all that. Um, No, 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 uh, no. Oh, crap. Go back in there. All that goes in there. My repair glue is even over here. Oh, uh, I need those dry grass chunks. I need more dry dry grass chunks. Why can't I say that today? Do gold cards have any effect? No, they're purely a, a collectible. There is no effect to dry to to dry grass chunks to gold cards. Man, my brain does not want to function today. I am sorry. How many gold cards do I have? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. I have 11 right now on this playthrough. How do you play in the public test build? If you're on Steam, right click on the game and on your Steam menu. Go to properties, go to betas, click on the drop down and select public test build. If you're on Xbox, whether you're on the actual Xbox or the Xbox Insider Hub app on the PC, you need to have the Xbox Insider Hub installed. Then you search for Grounded. You have to own your copy of Grounded and you can get in and be able to play. But the public test build should be coming out of, according to my sources, it should be coming out of um, preview or uh, testing. The new update should come out of testing sometime this week. Why are those? Okay, those are turned because they have to be turned. That's fine. Okay. What do we got shaken over here? We still haven't finished that yet. I need more weed stems. Uh, do I even have a pallet built? Now that I'm thinking about it. Do I even have a pallet built over here to make my life that much faster? It does not seem like it. Interesting. Okay. Uh, let's try to get some pallets built. We're going to try to make building today go a little bit faster, shall we? Instead of us sitting here having to run all over the friggin' place. All right. Let's get both of those built. There we go. Bada bing. Just need some pebblets. You, I just need... So both of them just need some pebblets. We can get those. We won't waste a trip, though. We'll grab some stuff over here while we're over here. I need some extra sap. Always respect the sap. Always grab it. Or not. Or, yeah, thank you. Okay. Very good. Pebblets, pebblets. You guys got any rocks? Sim needs some rocks. You guys got any? I see one. Thank you. He's got any more rocks. I see two, three, four. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Thanks for all the rocks. We're good now. All right, let's get some grass. We'll make this much grass work for now. We don't need a full run, but... Ooh, I need to eat. Nice. Did you know Grounded fixed the problem where you could get uh, gulped by the koi fish? It doesn't delete your stuff. 
Do I know if they fix that problem? It's not supposed to delete your stuff. Unless you have it set inside of your game mode to lose your backpack, it shouldn't delete your stuff. Without building a fortress on top of the termite mound, except for the bug spawns, and it's pretty defendable with only two ways up uh, that I know of. Uh, I haven't thought about building up there, no. Uh, personally, all of my building stuff is all done um, in larger open areas that are away from bug nests because I really don't like to be near all the bug nests so that way I don't get invaded all the time. Because I'm not a big fan of getting invaded in the game. Thoth, how's it going? Welcome to the stream. Perfect. Run this in here and then just build some uh, build some walls or build some floors. There we go. All right, let's uh, let's start with that second floor. We're gonna grab uh, this on the ground and fill it in about five seconds with all the grass that's over here. There's a plethora of it. All right, let's eat before we do anything else. You have a tree base. Since you can place the sap collectors on the tree, you literally have five thousand sap. That's how you do it. Sap is a great thing to keep all the time. Because you know what you could do if you get yourself a bunch of sap collectors? You can use sap to make question mark smoothies. Sap is such a versatile thing that you could just use a ton of it to make all the different stuff. Alright. And then the healing bandages that you can make with them if you get the up, uh, bandage upgrade is even better too. Uh, this is the... My shirt is not sweaty. It's just the design that I'm wearing. It happens to be one of my Hawaiian shirts that I wear. I wear these whenever it's hot outside. I'm going to be spending any time outside. Because they're really light and airy. They're like a really light fabric. I don't ever wear them while I'm streaming normally. So this is just different for me. I don't remember why I need more dry grass, but we're going to grab it anyway. We'll see if that does it. I'm not sure what's going on with it. It kept dropping my frame rate really bad. I'm not sure why. Yeah, it might have been my internet there for a second that just dropped out. It was, it's been funny all day, but it looks like that I got it up now. Are we good now? How's everything? Is everything working for you guys now? Sorry about the crappy stream in the beginning. I didn't realize that it was chopping there for a second. If you guys see that it starts cutting out like that, just send me a message because uh, I didn't see that it was doing that. But I think that we're good now. We're good now? Okay. Good, 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 good. Okay. Oh, uh, it's going good. Good to see you. Seems good. All right. Cool. Let's hope it stays that way going forward. So it cuts out for you. Well, just try to refresh your stream really quick. I was looking at the, the, the people that were watching. I'm like, why is it going down so much? What is going on? But it seems like that everything's good now. I'm not dropping frames anymore. So... I think that we're good. I think that we're good now. So, all right. I'm going to bring this guy over this way so I could cut down that big old weed that's right there. All good there? Perfect. All right. I had to restart my Streamlabs, like literally shut it down and sh uh, start it back up again. But I think that fixed the biggest pro the big problem of it. So I think we're good. You know what? I'm going to take this and I'm going to put it down here just to be safe. Oh, wait, is this that weed that you can cut and cut and cut and cut and cut and it doesn't ever cut down? That's this one, right? Crap. Why did I come over here? Burr weeds. That's why I came over here. Do better next time, Sim. Don't sit there and try to cut down weeds that you can't cut down. Timber!
Well, that didn't give me very many stems at all. Maybe a bunch of balls, but it didn't give me any stems. Yeah, let's move on to the next one. Moving on to the next one. LG, how's it going? You're kind of disappointed when it came out on the 27th. You thought it was coming out on the 1st? Yeah. You know what I'm kind of interested by? Why the heck this um, public test is still in public test? It would make sense that they're going to keep this public test all the way until the update. I mean, it's already been active for almost a month. In a couple days, it's going to be a month. I got a lot of spiky balls. Um, agreed. Yeah, those big weeds really do need to drop more weed stems. You guys like my spiky ball dance? All right, good. It looks like people are coming back now, and they're like, Hey, look, SimStream Sim stream isn't actually broken. Like, yeah, yeah, sorry. Fall that way. No, not that way. Dang it. Not that way. Whatever. Good enough, I guess, for now. Oh, actually, there's this one that's right here. <laughs> I need a doctor to look at that. You guys aren't happy with all of my spiky balls? You guys... <laughs> uh, this is getting weird. <laughs> all right. That is quite a few planks. So let's go back now. Or stems, I should say. Let's head on back to the castle and get some more stuff built. Yeah, that's the thing. It's not out yet, but everybody's been saying it's going to come out this week. Literally, all of my sources are saying this week. So if it doesn't come out this week, it's literally just like a, a, a slap from the developers at this point. Are they named Spiky by chance? Who told you? Hey. Well, at least this part of the floor is going to be done. Yo. Yo. I need some acorn shells to finish up that floor. Although, now that I'm looking at that, I've been to build that right there. Because if I do the second one, if we do the second floor, it needs to be flipped. Uh, Yep, there we go. Yeah, that's going to face up that way. I need it to face that way. Which means I need this. Let me go down here and grab all my stuff. Is that all of it? It looks like all of it. All right, here, hop up here. So if that's there, because that's where I need that to come, where do you go to? <laughs> right there. That's like that. I could have it right there. Come on. So if I take this and I put it down right there, this one's going to end up right there. You know what? I can make that work. I'm going to accept that. I'm going to make that work. I can't do that right now. Okay. Get some light in here. Good. I'll fix up those lights in a minute. That down for now. What's my opinion on the Orchid Mantis? I'm excited for a new boss. Um, I'm hoping she's not the only boss, at least that I've seen so far. I don't think she will be. But I'm hoping she's not the only boss. And to be honest, I, I think that she's probably going to get a cool armor set. But I'm really hoping that we get another perk like we did with the Broodmother from her. <laughs> Um, I think that the, the look of it, from what I've seen so far, she looks fantastic. Like, her graphics look great. And 
I'm now super, super happy, like I said earlier in the stream, that I'm getting a new graphics card that's going to make it so I can, you know, crank her to max uh, quality and really see what she's looking like. Um, but... Yeah, I'm, I'm excited about the Orchid Manus. I think that she's going to be really cool looking. Don't put the coal torch in the uh, on a weapon mount because it loses durability while it's not in use. That's a good thing to have, like if if you just want it to light up a room, right? And you know that you're ex ex accepting that uh, the fact you're going to lose durability on it. But I agree. If you don't want it to lose durability, don't leave it on one of those. There we go. We're getting some progress done today. We've already got way more done than we normally do in a stream, so I'm happy about that. Got a lot of floor done already. We're going to get even more floor done, then we're going to work on the armor reel for a little while, and it's going to be good. It's going to be good. I kind of had a feeling there weren't going to be as many people today in the stream, which is fine. I, you know, if you don't want to be here, I don't want to be here. Stuff happens. But, uh, I appreciate everybody that's here. So thank you all so much for being here. It does mean a lot to me. So thank you. You're excited about the scythe weapon? I'm hoping that with 1.0, we get more weapons, personally. Like... Like, not only the scythe weapon, I hope we get even more. Because, really, I feel like that we are due more weapons than what, what we have for what's in here. If I just have to walk around that way, and then can jump up and climb up, and then it'll be right there. and that'll be... Only the best of the best is here today? That's right, Nima, so thank you for being here. What do we got? You need sap. There's some sap. What do you need? You got nothing in you. Waste. You also, oh, you have some, oh, 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 I'll take those, thank you. Anything else? Uh, no, the rest of that is crap. All right, cool. Oh, yeah, I still got to do the little, the little staircase that's out here in this floor that's in here to give me my little landing pad where I can fight things off if I so need to. Oh, uh, where did I get my aphid toy? You want one? Oh, you mean this guy? Where did I get this from? Um, one of my awesome fans actually made it for me. So Curly Girl Creations made this for me. Um, she sent me this one and... And this one. I actually have uh, my own little Similot Knight too. Got his shield and a sword and everything like that. So, yeah, it's, uh, made both of those for me. And I am absolutely in love with both of them. I can't wait to see what else um, I end up getting, like, for my Similot stuff. I already saw, like, there was a, a tattoo artist that I found on on YouTube, the or on Twitch the other... Twitter, not Twitch. I found it on uh, Twitch the other day. Um, And... I'm seriously, seriously contemplating um, having that person draw up something for me to get tattooed because drawing means a lot to me. And I told myself, uh, in order for me to get a tattoo, the, the game that I get a tattoo on, the first one, is whatever game gets me to a million views on one video first. Um, but I don't think that's going to happen on this channel, at least not for a long, long time. So... I'm holding off uh, that thought, and because Grounded's meant so much and they're coming into 1.0, like I bought a shirt specifically for my 1.0 live streams and series. I bought, um, I have some other stuff coming in that I'm really excited about. I have the graphics card coming in, like I said, so. Uh, what new weapon class would you be excited about for them to add to the game, possibly? Um... Not weapon class, just weapon ability, and that's to dual wield. 
If I could grab two of these axes and go Berserker with two of them, I think that would be really, really cool. Uh, other than that, um... Yeah, I, I don't I don't really have one. Maybe like a, a boomerang or a slingshot. A boomerang would be really, really hard for them to put in, but still it would be cool. I need a lot more torches in here. I do not have enough torches in this base. It is so incredibly dark in here. It's ridiculous. I need some more sprigs, some more sap. I don't have any more sap. So we're going to sleep till morning. Yep. Pseudo Gamer, you're absolutely right. Yeah, Edgar, if you have one for... If you have a... Uh, a... Link for Curly, please let me know. And I'll... and Or go ahead and share it. Uh, also, Nima, if you want to send me a picture of your uh, plushie, I can go ahead and show that on the stream right now if you want as well. You can take a picture of it and send it to me. If you have one. If not, it's all cool too. If you even want to. Oh, my... Uh, I need my palette. Oh, come on, really? What new bug would I want added? I uh, want the devs to be added in the game the most. Uh, something... I've, I've said this before and I'll say it again. I... I... Really, 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 really... Want there to be more of a reason to go out at night. The only reason to go out at night in this game. The only reason is for fireflies. That's the only reason to go out at night. Otherwise, it's a completely pointless part of the game it's just dark you know yeah it adds the spookiness or whatever of the game and adds the realism but to me it's like there's there's no benefit to it right the only benefit you get is to be able to make a certain lantern um or being able to um or to be able to make a, a headlamp right and both are great both are great don't get me wrong both are great but in my opinion, I, I feel like we just, we need more of a reason to go out at night. So, I mean, if we could get, like, some moths, or we could get, like, uh, some crickets, some cockroaches, something that specifically comes out at night that's really, really worth you coming out at night and exploring more than just the, the current fireflies, that's what I would love to see. Um, all right, hang on a second. But here, I'm going to just drag this down here. Really, Look how cute this is. Look at it. Look how cute that is. That's absolutely fantastic. I really like that, Nima. That looks really, really cute. I like that. Thank you for sending that over. A cicada event? Yeah, that would be really cool. Just, just something that... That gives me a reason, right? Because you guys know I don't really like nighttime in games. I I don't like when it's just dark and it's dark just so you can't see. I mean, I, I never was really a big fan of horror games, although I'm playing Resident Evil, which I'll be holding off on playing that until I get my graphics card on Friday because it's just going to make that, that whole playthrough better once I get that. Um, but all in all, um, I... I just, I want more, I, I need more reason, right? I, I can't do this, this, uh, let's go out and, and, and just get fireflies stuff. So that's why I want the nighttime creatures really, really bad. No matter what it is, even if it's like one other thing that specifically you only get at that part of the night, I'd still be fine with that. Like just, just anything that just gives me that feel, you know what I mean? And I don't think it's asking too much.
Go up the recipe for red uh for rad nuggets isn't gonna be difficult like ox horns the more di um i don't know what it's going to be i'm assuming it's probably going to be using parts of bugs that are not in the game yet which is why we have not seen those parts yet which is why they're not in the game so i think that it's going to wait until after the update comes out so we have bug parts from bugs that aren't even in the game yet Possibly the Black Widow spider, possibly other things like if they're going to put, well, or it could be the Mantis or something like that. I think that would be kind of lame cakes if they did something like that. Made it so you have to fight a boss in order to get the Rad Nuggets because Rad Nuggets are already rare as it is. But you are talking Tier 9 weapons. Now that you mentioned a cockroaches, what if they added cockroaches for the new armor and possibly for a new nighttime creature? See, Roberta, I think that's an, an absolutely fantastic idea. Something like that, where it's nighttime, difficult to fight, gives you an excellent reason to go out and and start hunting things. I mean, it's it just it gives you that bonus reason to go out at night. You know, I know some people would say they want more water bugs and stuff like that. But honestly, I think that the water bugs that we have already are are pretty good. Actually, I don't think that we need any more, in my opinion. I think we have plenty of water bugs at this point. I think that we could use more. Oh, crap. I did not mean to do that. Oh, did not mean to destroy me. that sucks. Uh, I think that the water bugs that we have are plenty. But I was trying. You think it'd be awesome if when you go down the spicy mint or salty path, your weapon would look different. Kind of disappointed that it looks the same no matter what. Yeah, I, I'm hoping with the next update, with the 1.0 update, Where's we get something like that. Because if you guys watched my animation video today, uh, you'll see that the developers actually went in and made it so the Coltana. I don't know if I have it on me. I don't has an actual animation and an effect when you swing it. Hey Colt, how's it going, buddy? Uh, speaking of Colt, one second, guys. I got to take a quick pause to tell Colt something. Uh, Colt, I have started playing horror games on my channel um, again. So yes, we can play Phasmophobia. Um, we just got to get it set up and then I just got to buy the game and get it installed. So we can set up a time to be able to do that. Uh, let's let's talk offline. We'll, I'll, I'll text you. I just want to let you know. Yeah, so Phasmo... Exactly. Yes, soon. Soon. We're going to get everybody in on it. It's going to be a good time. I'll probably even end up doing like two-part stream on it where I stream here and on Twitch with it. So we're going to have a good time. You hope that they add leeches, centipedes, brown ants, and scorpions. I like the scorpions thing. I like the leeches thing. Brown ants, I could see. I could see the want for those. But we already have two types of ants in the yard. So I don't know if we would... I mean... It would be cool. But they would have to be like way more difficult. He clipped it so he can't back out. Yep. No, I'm not going to back out. I started playing Resident Evil... It, Resident Evil, as creepy as it was, it was a good time, um, and I'm I am honestly excited to start getting more of horror stuff on the channel because I know people like that, and I kind of like the excitement of them. So we'll see. Resident Evil isn't so for you. Uh, what I think the rest of the beginning cocktail recipe is going to be, I have a feeling it's going to be something like um, a special substance that you need to make after you get an instruction from a worksheet that's le that Wendell left behind. So the beginning cocktail is a bunch of different bug parts right now, but I feel like that it's probably going to be like some sort of acid or some sort of goop or something like that that you're going to end up using or that you're going to end up getting from Lord Only Knows. So...
What am I missing? Two acorn shells? Really? Okay, let's let's zip over and grab some water before we die. And then we can look for some acorn shells. Do I think we're going to go in the house? Not in 1.0. Um, with them talking that there's going to be more updates after 1.0, I think it's a more of a possibility. But I don't think it's going to happen uh, before 1.0. That's, that's way too much. If you guys think the update that they're providing us is already the biggest update we've ever gotten. It's this entire part of the yard and this area over here and this. It is just massive so i i don't think we're going to be going inside of the house now if they were to put that in this update would be so incredibly huge i think it would probably break the community with how excited everybody would be i could use something to drink i got you pete me too buddy a water filtration me too. let's hit it up together it. bud One point oh. got rick 1.0 the mushroom bricks could be dyed that they could What do you think the embiggening cocktail is going to look like? It's probably just going to be like a beaker that's got some stuff in it. I mean, it's a sciency thing that you're going to pour into the thing to get big, right? So I... Mm, it could be that. It could end up just being like a battery that you make. Uh, there's all sorts of different things it could be. Actually, you know what? Do I have my canteen on me? I don't have my canteen on me. Where's my canteen? I don't have a I don't have a backpack out there, so where the heck is the stupid thing? Can I make one? Whoops. I can make one. I need two pupil leather in order to make that, but I'm going to make this one nonetheless. Get myself a canteen. Equip that really quick. Scoop up these other two slots of water over here. That way I don't have to come back over here for more water if I don't have to. Order you a new chair? I need to order one of those too. Now that I've been sitting in this one for a while, I've I've literally worn this one out almost completely. And I need to know like because I think I got this one from like a staples, so I really need to get a new one. Tarantulas to the game? I feel like they would be too big. We already have a brood mother that's big enough. I feel like that any more bugs like that would just be too big. You got your new PC, DJ? That's great. Nice, nice, nice. This is coming together well. Look at that. That's coming together really well. Uh, Once, once 1.0 hits, can you go to the deck of the house and see what is the secret area or maybe see uh, under the deck in the i mean i could go and check that stuff once 1.0 comes out you guys can imagine i'm going to rip 1.0 a new one i'm going to be going over everything with that update if it's updated i'm going to cover it i am literally taking time off of work specifically just to cover the game which when i told my boss that he asked me if i was crazy and i told him no but I am I am taking time off of work just to, to cover the update. So don't worry. There's going to be plenty of Sir Simulot covering everything on the new update that's coming. If it's in the game, Sim's going to cover it. All this new scabby locations, all the uh, new armor, all the new weapons, all the story, all of everything. Where things are, how to do things, tips and tricks on fighting, whatever gets added. If you can think of it, it's going to be a video. Any news on the lab on the wall? Nothing yet, Saruman, but 
Uh, hopefully, I, actually, I'm, I can almost guarantee with the 1.0 update that that lab will either be filled or deleted. Because I'm not going to say it's going to be completed for sure. It's either going to get fi finished or it's going to get deleted. Julia's gone. When are we going to have a build off? Uh, we could do that in 1.0. I think it'd be an excellent idea to do that in 1.0 cult. Um, we'll get you in here so you could get a little bit of experience building in the game again. Because it's been... What's it been? S it's probably been, what, a year since you've played Grounded? So we definitely know we need to get you back up on your par on building. But I know you build something awesome if we could get you in here and get you going. Probably longer than that. Yeah, it's been a little while. Yeah, and then on top of all the videos I'm doing, I'm also going to be streaming. Cashflow with the five saying, what do you think about a human skeletons we can find in the game? Do you think they play an important role of our story? I think that their role has already been communicated to us. As weirdly as that sounds, I think it already has. If you think about the fact that they already made the little uh, video snippet of the trailer of them saying that uh, there was missing teens and that four more teens have gone missing, I think that's what they are. I think that those are other teens that are running around in the that were running around in the yard that were shrunken down that ended up either getting uh, killed, consumed, something like that that happened to them uh, in the yard. So I think that's what they are. But thank you so much for the extra support. I do appreciate that. I think the last time we played was when the Mint Hammer was new. Oh. Oh, God. <laughs> oh. 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 <laughs> that's so long ago. <laughs> that's... That's painful long ago. That's... Wow. That's some time, buddy. That is some time. Holy cow, that's some time. Um, that's like update one. Holy moly. Uh, just thinking, I mean, that's like, yeah, we gotta, we gotta get you guys back into this game. <laughs> it's a fun one to build in. As you can see, I like building in it. And the blueprinting system's good. Uh, you might have found where we're going to fight the mantis. I don't know if we're going to fight the mantis in a cave. What if they made it so you could go further up to the tree where there's June bugs in a... Oh, that'd be cool. I think that'd be really cool. We can actually go up in the tree. And I could see those being very tough to beat as well, yeah. Um, I need some grass, but not that much, so I'm not going to grab a pallet. I'm going to grab my stems pallet. I'm going to try to fill my stems pallet. Uh, but I'm going to grab eight grass planks on the way back. <clears throat> We're going to run down this way and grab some stems towards the jungle area. I know there's going to be some stems over there that we can grab. We'll do cult. Uh, don't even need to boil it. Gonna continue the hunt for this dang mountain goat? What mountain goat? I have no idea what goat you're talking about. But whatever it is, good luck. Will there be a cold biome? I I don't know if we're gonna get a cold biome. All I know is that it really sounded like a cold biome. 
when we were standing by the shed door. In fact, we can run up there before the end of the stream and check it out. I'll show you guys what I'm talking about. It seriously sounds like a cold biome. Do we have any more around here that I missed other than cutting down another one? Yeah, I did. Okay. I see it over there. Way of the Hunter. Is that like one of those uh, Sasquatch, like the Sasquatch hunting game, Colt? Is that like what it is? Or is it actually like a hunting simulation game? Forgive my lack of knowledge on hunting games all. Right, we'll talk to you later. Thanks for hanging out for a little while. If it ever happened to the tree, you could see termites being there. I agree. I definitely agree. What game is this, you ask? Look there. It's right there in the title. Right right below what you're watching. It's right there. Um, It's a hunting simulator, kind of like Call of the Wild with some more advanced stuff in it, like herd population control. That's actually kind of interesting. I've been hunting in real life. Oh, hunting. And all I caught was a buzz. And I also got very cold, but that's that that was the whole experience. So yeah, me and me and hunting don't get along cuz I'm just not very Picky good bomb. at it. Let's get this put over here. I'm going to need that there. I'm going to need to put some of this up here. I'm going to do that. Boom. Go. 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 We're going to get that finished up in a little bit. Okay. Boom. All right. Very nice. I also should finish this too, but I need seven pebblets for it. So let's go throw this on this pallet so that way it's at least organized. Did you go to sleep? Uh, if you're tired, yes. Yeah, if you're tired, you should. Sleep is good. The redeemables are great, yeah. Cheers. Needs an update or 20. What I'm going to do, I'm going to do this. I'm going to take some brick walls in here. Here. Over, over. And let's see, what did I have over here? I have technically... One, two. That's one, two, which means it needs to come out right there, right there, and then right there. But what I'm what I also want to do is get rid of that. Get rid of that and get rid of that. Build here to go. I can't put that up because it's unsupported for now. I'm gonna go mounted arch there and there. And then, if I can, a half wall. Oh, God, that sucks, like, looking like that. Oh, suppose if I went up above, 
That doesn't look too terrible. I'm gonna replace some of these with, uh... Um... Whatever those walls are here soon. Windowed walls. But for now... We'll get these put up. This adds a little bit more to the front of the castle. Makes it look even better as you're sliding in. Gives you a little something something and then if I take these parapeted walls that and I'm out of mushrooms. I'm gonna have to go back and get more mushrooms out of my ovens. Half walls? I have been wanting half walls in this game for a very long time. I really wish we could have half walls in this game. I have wanted that for a long time. I'm hoping they come to the game at some point. I haven't seen it coming anytime soon, but we could keep our fingers crossed. You're, you're running my stream with 800 frames per second? That's good! <laughs> Night, Nima. Get some rest. We'll talk to you later. Thanks for hanging out. Yeah, I, I agree. I was kind of... I was kind of irked that they didn't release the update today. I'm not really sure what they're working on with it. Because they haven't given us an update since last Thursday to it. And, I mean, I know that, like, I'm not the master of everything that they're working on. But it, it just, it seems strange to me that we haven't gotten an update yet. No man's gaming. Uh, make editing is is kind of the biggest pain in the butt when it comes to making videos. Not very good at it. Um, and I told myself when my videos average, I think it's what was my number? I think it was twenty five hundred views a video. Like all of them are getting over twenty five hundred views a video. That I'm probably gonna get an editor, just because I want it to be the best quality for you guys. And I am crap at editing. Um, I've watched myself go through and try to edit my videos and I am not very good at it. Uh, my edits are poor, they're mistimed and stuff like that. So uh, I thought about it, but it's gonna be a while before anything like that happens. Like I said, probably at least with the way that things are going with the channel right now, at least three years before that can happen. I am still well I'm still well far from being able to be able to do that. Preach. Boom, thank you so much for subscribing. No water filtration tablets need better than starving, I think. That's why I like streaming. Streaming's fun. I like streaming just because I like to hang out with you guys. Personally, um, I like out of the out of everything, I love making videos because it's just you, the game, and the camera, and you're just going, going, going. But it's like a 50-50 cut for me on which one I like more. Or if I'm making videos, because videos are fun because it's you and the game and you're just kind of having fun together. Um but streaming, I get to hang out with all of you guys, which makes it so much more fun. So it's like, I'm here or there on it. I, I like doing both. The editing, it's not, it's not a crazy amount of fun to edit things, but you know, every job has its perks and its, its downs. And if editing is literally the only down that I have to deal with, with, with uh, making videos for YouTube and stuff, I'm fine with that. 
What was I doing? Working on bricks. Um, I work in computers. That's all the information that I give people because uh, my job is kind of like my personal life and I try not to divulge too much of my personal life. It's better to keep some things personal and that's definitely one of them that I like to keep personal. I have no idea what happened to Rudar. I I um I heard that he put out a video explaining why he wasn't making videos, but I I don't I don't know what happened to him. Good YouTuber. Good YouTuber. Don't no idea what happened to him. Could be centipedes at the bottom of the tree. Yep. Agreed. I need a lot more grass planks now. What am I looking at for required materials? 59 more weed stems, 104 grass planks, 8 clay, 12 sap, 3 sprigs, 7 pebblets. Cool. Go ahead and add a little bit more to this side of the castle over here. Give us a nice wall like that. Um, and then give us a nice wall like... Mm, like this. I'm fine with the double window. The double window is okay. We'll do that. It's a good spot to tuck away a couple water. Uh... Couple water collectors, so I'm gonna put up two. So I could get a second one going. A little decent place place for a bunch of water to be stored. Uh is Grana adding animations in the cutscenes of 1.0? I'm assuming so, yes. You know what? I'm even gonna put in a water container back. Because then I could put all my extra water away. Build that. Boom! A while since I built one of those. No. So I need six tablets and a crap... Or I need 14 pebblets and a crap load of stems. I also need a lot more lights because there's definitely not enough light in here. I could do... I'm not a huge fan of the slime mold sconces, but I could do a chandelier in here, if it still lets you. Yeah, it still lets you. I gotta move that one down a little bit. We'll get it there. Oops, that's not the right spot for that. Here, let me go in here and do that this way. I think that's about right. Maybe this one. It moved slightly. I think that's about right. So now I just need slime mold sconces, a bunch of crude rope, and then uh, some sap grind hub and glub, grub goop. I can get a lot of that here. But I think they should have char charcoal chandeliers. Yes. Trap door spiders would be something cool because it would give you something to watch out for on the ground while you're running around. But you still got to be careful with all those different things that you add to the game. It could really add some some crazy creepiness to the game. Um, I'm going to run over and see if I have any bug goop and stuff like that. So that way I can make that. We're going to see here. 
I'm also going to need some slime mold and a lot more... A lot more, uh... Crude rope, it's looking like. Voice lines and cutscenes, Zach, I know they're going to be in the game. They finished all of the voice lines for Wendell, and I think that they're still working on finishing the ones for Burgle? I told them if they ever need a random person to do a voice in the game, I'm totally 100% down. Like, even if it's on, like, one random tape of a Don't survivor in the backyard that was dying, and all it is is screaming, I'm doing it. I'd totally do it. I'd be like, let me do it. Please, I will do it for you. I'll be the master of screaming for your game. Um, now I'm going to need to go get Firefly Goo, and that's my luck. Telling everybody I don't want to go get Firefly Goo. Ah, no, I don't. Okay, good. Um, I need more sap. Sap's actually not that hard to come by. Uh, 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 uh. Okay. Is the update out yet? Nope. Not that I've seen, lest they released it while I've been streaming. Oh. Which I don't see that Worse it has, because it would Brussels tell me that sprouts. I need to get out of the public test. And also, I'm pretty sure I'd have about 95 people messaging me that they, that it's not a public test. And then I get to make the really, really long video of me <laughs> reading really every single terrifying. one of the patch notes. Grab some web, web for the water? Uh, I didn't need to. Uh, the only thing I need for my water for my um, water catchers are um, stems and wheat and rocks. They haven't even given a rough estimate yet. All my sources told me that it was going to be this week, so if it's not this week, I'm going to be faithfully disappointed. But you know, they love to prove me wrong. You're kind of curious, wonder how Grounded is going to do, or what Grounded's going to do. Not how Grounded's going to do, but what Grounded's going to do with the campaign. So the campaign, to me, is something that is... I'm definitely interested in it. it you know, it's... We've had the campaign for a very, very long time. The campaign's been in the game. And personally, I think that... When it finally comes to a close, it's going to be so different that the game's actually coming to a close that I feel like that there's going to be a lot of people who are both excited and are like, wow, that was really awesome. But then there's also going to be those choice people who are like, that's how they en ended the campaign. I don't like that. And you know what? I... I very well could be one of those people that are like, wow, that's how they ended the campaign. But you know what? You don't know until you play it, so you know I'm going to be playing it. Sorry, I'm just doing a little focus build time here for a second. Yo. Mm -mm 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 -mm. And then I need some torches. I can actually see what I'm doing here. 
That is not right. Say something about that look funny. It's just not right. You don't want to do it right there. And there it looks just silly, so... Am I going to have to use these? I guess we can use them. There we go, that kind of looks silly and I like it. There. Strange, but I like it. In fact, the ant lion would be really creepy. Yes, you've been playing for a while. You're having a hard time finding a need for multi bases. Um, multi bases are more like a, an end game kind of luxury. At, multi bases are things that are like, okay, well, this is going to be nice for um, me to run around and have some of this somewhere closer to where I'm exploring or prepping for this and stuff like that or making it so you have some zipline towers so you can get around the ba around the, the uh, map easier stuff like that multi bases are most definitely a end game thing they're not something that um, everybody needs right in the beginning of the game for sure multi bases are are very very much so late game Have a good night, Scott Rick. Thanks for uh, thanks for hanging out. Thanks for the tips and stuff, and uh, asking the questions you did. Do appreciate it. Thank you, thank you, thank you. You have a bad phobia of spiders and you played this game with friends a long time ago. You saw a wolf spider before and got attacked by one and oh yeah, that I could understand why that'd freak you out. If building was tweaked, a lot more people would enjoy doing so. Uh what tweaks do you think need to be made? Just honestly curious, what tweaks do you think need to be made? Uh, parasites, I, I don't feel like that we need that because we already have mushrooms in the game that are kind of like doing that kind of thing already. So parasites, I think are, aren't, aren't quite needed. I feel like the building is clunky. I wonder if there's some stuff I'm going to build inside that room. What do you guys think? You think there's something in there that needs to be built? Well, at least we could get the floors done. Okay, so the floor in here is completely done. Get that one built. And then I can even go over here and get a little bit built out here. Dun 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 dun. Go. A little bit done out there. I need some grass for up there. I have the sap for that. And I can get a couple of these built. It'll help lighten up that space a little bit more. I still need all of the crude rope in the world. And some slime mold stocks. Let's go get some slime mold stocks, maybe some more crude rope, some more mushrooms, and anything in my other base that might help me from what I need. 
Is this the wo world? Wo wo mode world? No, it is not. My wo mode world is um, not nearly this far along, and I do not stream that world. I only, um, I only make videos off of that world. Rebel Scout, how's it going? Ah, uh, Caleb, I can understand that. Building up high does kind of stink sometimes. Okay, let's see here. What do I need for building? I need a lot of clay for all of the armor dummies that I made. I need a lot of acorn shells, some more weed stems, some pebblets, sap. Do I have those sap collectors? I do have those sap collectors working overtime. Let me get those. There go. Very good. Very good. Very good. Very good. Very good. Sap collectors did some good work. Got me 20 sap. Where's my hammer? Is. I got a bunch of acorn tops, although I don't need them. Acorn bits, a lot more plant fiber. That way I can... How's it going, little guys? Uh, grab some more rope. More sap. How much sap did I need? Sap was 28. I have 21. Wasps and hornets are something that I've wanted in the game for a while. I think that uh, both of those would be cool to bring into the... Or at least one of them would be cool to bring into the game. Because it would give you another flying enemy. But we already have bees, so... If they were to add them, they would have to be, like, only in a specific area. Because I feel like they'd be really, really aggressive. My favorite weapons are the Termite Axe and the Salt Morning Star. That's why I always keep one of each of them on me. But I think developers are looking to add more trap types to the game. Yes. Hey Tyler, how's it going? Do, 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 do. How much crude rope did I need? 41. I have 22. Enough to make 22 right now. Oh, come on. <laughs> oh, that'll happen. That'll happen to the best of us. Just walked out right into an infected wolf spider and got demolished. He's... You just go back in your hole. He said go back in your hole. Go to your hole. Go to your hole. Good now? 15 pebblets. Doing good. Had to be streaming. Had a really good day. Fun with the family. Stuff like that. So it's been a good one. No water filtration tablets needed. Yeah, no kidding. Especially if you're just going to get killed by that infected wolf spider over there. Who cares if you got water filtration or not? You're going to end up dying anyway. Will you quit making scary, creepy noises and just go go away? Yeah, what are you doing over by my base? Be gone! Technically, yes. Yellow jackets are teased on the loading screen. Okay. While I'm wearing my ant armor, I'm going to go down into the ant hill. And I'm actually going to grab some slime molds. Slime molds, uh, slime mold stocks.
Can I make a torch? Actual torch that I use, not, you know, crappy torch that I hang on the wall. Uh... Ten. Okay, because I'm about to go on the ant hill and it's just going to be dark in there, so it's better if I at least have something to light the way while I'm in there. The armor change is great. I think this should add ticks. Um, I think it'd be cool because it could do like a damage over time thing, like make it so you have an effect called bleeding. I think that'd be pretty cool. Where's my charcoal torch hanging on the wall back in my base? Just in too lazy to go grab it, I guess. By the power of Helion, champion of the sun. Yep. Here you go, Pete. Get your super nerd on, buddy. Hey guys, how you doing? I'm not here to take anything except for slime mold torches. How you guys doing? Got some nice babies around here. Full respect of having many babies, all right? Enjoy your, your multiple babies all the time. You guys are all right in my book. Technically, girls. Because most species of ant, all of the ants are girls. It's only very, very few males that are actually ever produced in an ant colony. And they're normally just used for mating. How many slime molds do I need? Eight. Okay, I got plenty of those now. Sweet. You guys got any rocks? There's a rock of style. There's a style nugget for me. Look, a chip that I've already picked up but we'll bring back up there anyway. Oh, look, some more ant armor. Or uh, the bee armor's in here. Um, if the bee armor's in here, I might as well go grab the rest of it so we can put it into the armory. The armory's gonna need some stuff in it anywho, so... Let's go grab the other two pieces really fast. That's a big rock of style. How you doing? That's another rock of style. Look at all your guys' nice babies that are around. I'm here just for the pebblets, so... I mean, I guess if there's some style nuggets around and stuff, I'm not going to say no. But I'm not really, like looking for those, if you know what I mean. If you're picking up on what I'm throwing down. That's different. Ow. We might be getting infected ants in the future. Maybe an entire infected ant hill. Oh, inventory's full. Ow. Uh, I don't need this. And... I don't need this. Okay, then I just gotta run over here and grab the last part, and then we'll get out of here. An infected ant colony needs to be a thing, yeah. He was saved with 3,500 days um, with 1,360,000 raw signs. Yes, I am known as, a, <laughs> as the Scrafferger King. Would love to send you a copy if you... Uh, if you uh, add me on Xbox, yeah. Just look up Sir Simulot. And then you could share the world. And I could check it out. I uh, missed my... I missed my place to go get my other thing. I think I gotta go in the water to get it, so... It's gonna get dark for a second! It's dark out. Alright, there we go. Now, let's go and equip my torch again. Tor equip my torch again. There's the light. Tough Nugget! Tough Nugget! Tough Nugget! Style Nuggets! Leg Armor! 
leaving, falling. <laughs> Uh, the the final 1.0 update should come out on the 27th. The um, home stretch update. So this update should come out sometime. Should. Should come out sometime this week. I don't want your babies. I just want your rocks. Because I, I don't have any need for a bunch of eggs right now. I have no, no need for brat bursts. See you later. All right, let's go feed my, my uh, pets. They need food. That's why I didn't throw away the raw meat slurry. I was like, I'll just throw this away. And I'm like, wait, I need to feed my gnat. <sighs> Uh, it's just a straight update, Dayton. There is no public test build for 1.0. I already asked that question and have been confirmed that there will not be a public test build for 1.0. Um, I, uh, I also, just as a little fun note, did ask if I could get early access to 1.0 uh, to help them with closed testing that I would have to sign an NDA in order to do. Uh, and I was also denied there, too. So... They're not doing even closed testing. They are only doing in-house testing and then launching 1.0. So, it's gonna be big. Midnight, we'll talk to you later. Thanks for hanging out for a little while. All right, where is my gnat? Where are you, buddy? I know you're sad. Where are you? Some of you are floating around over here somewhere. Are you actually in the house? Nope. Where are you floating around? Where are you? Oh, you're underneath. Come here. Come here. Oh, you have you have spoiled meat slurry in there. You're good. You have food. You're not sad. Here's a pet for you, though. There we go. There's a little bit of attention for you, buddy. All right, I'm out. See you later. He wasn't actually here for a while. You just got here. Oh, okay. Well, nonetheless, thank you so much for stopping by. Let's get rid of this torch. We don't need this on right now. Also, put Squire McFluff and Poof away. You don't want him to go out and get hurt, so keep him put away. Is the Xbox or similar out with 63 followers? If it's me, we're in, like, if it's like a... Look, you stupid bastard! You've got no arms left! Yes, I have! Look! Just a flesh wound. If it's, uh, like a I'm Fallout playing! power armor suit or something like that in a car, that's the right one. I don't know how many people are following me on Xbox, to be completely honest. Kevin, what's going on? Good to see you again. Welcome to the stream. Mm -hmm. Hey, we're at, we're almost to 50 likes. Three more people hit the like button. We're at 50 likes. Thank you, guys. Appreciate that. Why they remove stem walls? You miss those uh, sturdy stem walls a lot. Uh... Uh, stem walls. They're not removed. They're right there. Windowed stem wall. I go back over here to walls. There's the stem wall right there. They didn't remove stem walls. 34 days to 1.0. Nice. You have all four different types of walls. Oh, I forgot I need the slime a slime mold for that. Hmm.
I need the, not the slime mold, what am I saying? Bad Sim, you need the crude rope. You need to go over to your other base and make crude rope. A lot of it. I also need a lot of clay. I think these were the only ones that were missing the acorn shells. I gotta get a lot of crude rope. Okay. <clears throat> and then the sap is for the chests. Sap's for the chests. Need some clover leaves. No biggie there either. And a couple more acorn shells. Pretty hyped for 1.0. Especially Sims 2. Well, you guys, like I said, uh, the two the two days after the stream, so the 27th and the 28th, I have those two days off of work. So, and I've already told my wife and she's, you know, me and her have worked it out and stuff. I'm literally going to start streaming and making videos non-stop for two days. The only time I'm not either going to be streaming or making videos for Grounded within those two days are when I'm sleeping. Otherwise, that's all I'm doing. I'm going to be like eating granola bars and drinking water. Like, that's it. I'm just going to be cranking content out. I'm assuming probably 12 to 20 videos and stuff within those two days, if not more. Depending on how much I need to cover, there could be like 15 to 30 videos between those two days. Which is way too much for one stream. Or for one, for two days. And also, YouTube's going to throw a huge fit about that because there's going to be way too many videos going up in those two days. But... But yeah, it's going to be a lot. <laughs> Eat more than granola, though? Yeah. <laughs> Send you some cereal to eat straight from the bag. We're going to this clean. again, Edgar. Better than starving. I think. That's another funny video thing. Edgar, I, I've been, I was actually putting some thought to that. Um, I was putting some serious thought to doing some of those like cooking reaction videos because like I said, I'm not like super snobby when it comes to cooking, but I definitely am highly opinionated when it comes to cooking. And I feel like that it would kind of be pretty funny with some of the, the cooking reactions that I could do. Who remembers when Sim ate the bugs on the channel? Um, I am doing that again for Thankmas. That's going to happen for Thankmas again. Um, I am doing... I might do that during the streams. The 1.0 streams. I know I got some fun stuff planned for the 1.0 streams as well. Because, I mean, it, we're really talking the biggest update to Grounded ever, right? So you guys know I'm going to be having fun in the streams. I'm probably going to eat bugs during them. I'm going to... Empty my backpack because there's too much crap in it. Um, all right, let's see. What can I get rid of? This, I don't need that. Uh, what else? I need the rocks. Hmm. I don't need the spiky burrs right now. Let me see. These tough nuggets and the style nuggets I'm going to put away for now as well. Keep the rocks. I didn't even need to collect rocks. I had rocks. I don't think I have any more clay, which sucks. But it is what it is. Okay. <laughs> What's my favorite bug that's in the game? Bees. Coming? Um. Well, I only know of the two that are coming, so probably the praying mantis. Hmm. <laughs> 
gonna need all the videos from 1.0 it's gonna be it's gonna be fun there's gonna be tutorials there's gonna be walkthroughs there's gonna be opinions there's gonna be how to's there's going to be um reading all the, the patch notes and stuff like that exploration videos there's gonna be all sorts of stuff and the thing is right is the streams are going to be spread out between youtube and twitch so there's going to be probably eight hours of streaming a day four hours on youtube four hours on twitch and it's going to be cut into two different segments so there's probably going to be like a morning segment and an evening segment and then all the videos will be recorded and uploaded in between there and going live on the channel throughout that time like i said i'm i'm gonna kind of go a little crazy with with everything that i'm loading to the channel it's gonna be just too much but it's gonna be fine because you know what you know, I was given the, the, the title from the developers of the game a long time ago of, of Grounded Guru, and while I still believe I hold that crown, at least in my book, um, there's some people who definitely do a better technical job than me, but if I'm going to just continue rocking Grounded all the time, I never grabbed all of my, my stems, or all of my, oh, bad sim. I need to grab clover leaves. I didn't grab all my crude rope is what I was saying. I also need a crap load of sprigs. How many sprigs do I need? I need 52 sprigs. And 151 clay. Well, I know where I could go get all of that. Here, I'm going to take this armor. Oh, wow, I have bricks in here, too. I didn't know I had so many bricks over here. Here, we're going to throw those in there. Uh, so, sure, sure. Um, it might be a, f a few minutes. Um, I actually, guys, um, in about eight minutes from now, I'm actually going to take a quick turn and I'm going to go stream over on Twitch. I'm literally going to pause the game, pause what I'm doing right here. I'm going to stop streaming on YouTube. I'm going to go over to Twitch and start streaming. So if you guys want to watch me on Twitch, Put exclamation point Twitch in the chat right now. It'll pop up a link for you guys, and you can go over there and continue watching this over there. So in eight, seven minutes now, I'm going to do that. Hunter, it's not out yet, but I am still the same sim a lot over there. It's just a different platform you guys can go hang out in, and it's kind of fun over there. Only the like the closest people who like watching me go over there, I, it seems like. So it's a little bit more chill. So yeah, if that's something that interests you guys, if you guys want more Sir Sim, you guys just want to hang out and chat more tonight, you're more than welcome to go over there. I just think I think I just hit 700 followers over there, which I'm pretty pumped about. That was a big deal for me to hit 700. So if you guys want to go over there, chat, hang out. Um, it's really, it is a good time. We'll call it, you know, Sim a lot after dark because I know it's starting to get night. It's starting to get pretty late for some people. Daniel, thank you so much for going over and following. Yeah! <laughs> Do you know why the rock is blocking something in Sandbox Castle? You're guessing it's uh, going to be another boss for 1.0. I don't know what it's going to be, but you watch there, but don't chat. It's Y'all don't have to chat if you don't want to. Y'all are more than welcome just to hang out. Okay. I have some healing stuff. I'm going to need that for this run. We're going to go get sprigs and clay. Because I'm going to need a lot of both. Hey, people leather over here. I could have made a better canteen. Do have anything else over here that's worth a diddle? Oh, a little bit. Uh, Starfall, thank you so much for following. Also, Afferman, thank you so much for following over on Twitch. You guys are awesome. Thank you all so much for the support. We're going to have some fun over there tonight. Um, what are these? Grub leather scraps. Those are completely useless. 
I also have multiple torches here. We'll throw this torch in with all the other torches then. <laughs> so many torches for no reason. The thing to get the Twitch link is exclamation point Twitch, and it pops up right there. Also, guys, thank you everybody so much for 62 likes. We are seven away from 69. It's pretty cool. <laughs> Grab some mushrooms here, so that way I don't have to have Pete starving. Down, Pete. I'm gonna grab this plant fiber while I'm over here, because I need that. I'm not gonna worry about the sprigs, because I'm going to the sprig harvesting area, so I'm not really worried about that. I'm gonna need some water if I can't find a dew drop. I haven't been in this area in a while. Xbox One Geek, thanks so much for going and following over on Twitch. Um, I haven't been in this area in some time in this playthrough. No, no, no. Bad. Bad. Bad Orb Weaver. Ouch, I didn't block in time. You suck. This is why I wanted to bring healing items. Not even going to pick up your body. That's inventory room I don't care to use. Um, this, this cola can should have a little bit of sodi pop in it. Thank you. Perfect. And then right around here, there should be... Yep, there's the plank, which means right over this way is the sprig field. And the sprig field's where you go when you just want a crap load of sprigs. And see me, all I need 51 of them. Definitely need some sprigs. I'm going to need even more because I'm actually going to be putting up railings as well. I'm going to need a lot of sprigs. Yes, this place right over here. This is the sprig field. Get yourself some sprigs. You guys know what it is? Look at them all. This is where to go when you need a crap load of sprigs. So that's what I do over here. I come back and grab a crap load of them. You grab like... Grab like 60 or 70 of them. You just fill my inventory full of sprigs. What else did I say I wanted to grab too? Play as well. I'm gonna grab a hundred sprigs. Quick hundo sprigs. There we go. No wolf spider, por favor. To use my one healing item I brought with myself because, you know, of course I only brought one. Oh, sometimes I astound myself with how brilliant I am. Did I get the larva blade? I grabbed it way earlier. I probably need to pick it up again. But I'll do that um, probably a little bit later. I want to keep all my stuff. All right. Speaking of keeping all of my stuff, I am going to um, going to end the stream right here. So thank you all so much for watching the stream over here. You guys were absolutely fantastic. Hope you guys will check out the Twitch channel because we're going to be streaming over there in about two minutes. The only thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go over and fill up my water cup and then I'm going to press start streaming over there. Thank you everybody so much. I hope you guys had fun over here on YouTube. You guys did hit the like button on your way out and I will see you guys over on Twitch in just a moment. Talk to you a little bit. Bye.